Several breaking stories tonight. First, multimillionaire Jeffrey Epstein is found injured in his Manhattan jail cell while being held on federal sex trafficking charges. Good evening at 11. I'm Stephen Hall. And I'm Natalie Pascarella. A startling new twist in a case making headlines worldwide. There are questions tonight whether accused pedophile Jeffrey Epstein was attacked in a cell or tried to kill himself. Still trying to clear that up tonight. Chief Investigative Reporter Jonathan Dean joining us live in the newsroom with the breaking details. Jonathan, what do you know? Well, we know that Jeffrey Epstein is safe back inside a cell tonight on suicide watch. That according to several sources. And questions are swirling. Did he try to hurt himself or what really happened inside the Metropolitan Correctional Center. Details sketchy at this hour with investigators now trying to get answers. Several sources tell us the initial report is that Jeffrey Epstein was found on the floor in his cell in a fetal position, semi-conscious with marks to his neck. Investigators are trying to determine what happened to Epstein inside the Metropolitan Correctional Center in one of the secure areas of the jail. Two sources say Epstein may have tried to hang himself. A third source cautioned Epstein's injuries were not serious and questioned if Epstein might be seeking some kind of transfer. This, as a fourth source says, an assault has not been ruled out, that another man in the same area was questioned. Epstein was ordered held without bail since his arrest on the sex trafficking charges. He had asked to be housed in his Upper East Side mansion with an ankle bracelet and private guards. But the judge said he was a risk of flight and a danger, given the allegations he sexually abused underage girls. He has pleaded not guilty. Epstein had been housed with a former cop and accused killer. An attorney for that inmate says his client did not attack Epstein, that the two get along, and that Epstein was seen today and appears to be fine. Epstein's lawyer did not return a call for comment, as the investigation very much underway at the MCC. In the newsroom, Jonathan Deans, Newsful. Okay, Jonathan talking to sources tonight. We've also learned tonight the parent company of Victoria's Secret, L Brands, has launched an internal investigation involving Epstein. NBC News reporting that Epstein has ties to company founder Leslie Wexner and has been identified as a money manager of Wexner. Wexner says he stopped working with Epstein after allegations of sex abuse were made in the late 2000s. There have been recent reports that Epstein promised women jobs at Victoria's Secret. Those reports have not been confirmed by NBC News. The company released this statement saying, in part, while Mr. Epstein served as Mr. Wexner's personal money manager for a period that ended nearly 12 years ago, we do not believe he was ever employed by nor served as an authorized representative of the company.